I can still see everything, clearly defined images, but most of all, I can still remember the face of a frightened 15-year-old staring back at me in the mirror. This is the last image I have of myself. Rob Matthews was one of those kids destined for greatness. By the age of 21, he set his first world record in the 1500 metres. He has set 22 world records since. He's rubbed shoulders with Princess Anne and Lady Diana. He married his wife Sarah in 2007. They've got a child Thomas and another one on the way. Rob has achieved phenomenal success in his life and he did it all blind. I can't see anything other than the brightness of the sun. Um, ironically, I can't. Uh, and that really does dazzle me. Just put my sunglasses on, it's uh, still pretty bright out there. So, um, first of all, got the. This is a bit of a uh, tactile orientation for me um, with the carpet. So, if I um, hit that at about, um, I guess, 45 degrees, then I should be approximately on my way to the French doors. Okay. Now, obviously, I've got the um, green chair and the coffee table that I try and walk right between. They just brush it with my <laughs> leg there. I, I always talk um, like that, yeah, in the visual I sense, you know, like I. I Watched the telly. I, you know, I, I, I saw my mate the other day. You know, and um, it's just the just the way I talk. I, I don't, I don't really believe in making a distinction just because I'm blind. Rob always talks in positive terms of goals and objectives, so it's no surprise that a guy who already has an arm full of medals as a runner has set his eyes on yet another goal. One day he jumped on a bike gave triathlon a bash, and at the age of 49, he's reinvented himself as a cyclist. In May last year, Brendan Cameron, you know, tried, tried me out on the bike to see how, how good I was. And um, I was inducted into the cycling team. You know, he uh, provided the tandem and uh, allowed me to use it in the triathlon and uh, in September. Last year, I found myself on the Gold Coast keep competing for New Zealand, and you know that was that was an incredibly proud moment for me, competing with the silver fern on my chest and and actually winning the silver medal in the um, in the triathlon. Um, and since then, I've concentrated on the cycling 100 percent. Rob was barely in his teens and planning his whole life when he started losing his sight. He was born with retinitis pigmentosa. It's a degenerative eye condition. He was blind by the age of 20. Today, he's teamed up with tandem pilot William Harris, who's become the perfect training partner. I've ridden a bike for many years, and it didn't take me long at all to adjust to um, the actual style of riding. Um, it's, it is a lot different, but um, they just come natural. One of the key things is communication. Um, technic the technical aspect of the tandem is starting off as a huge part of it, and just getting that same momentum at the same time is a big thing, because if you fall over, it's, it's really easy um, to be done. Rob holds his life in my hands pretty much and you just got to be aware of everything around you. Um, it's really hard for me to um, look behind me to see traffic and I just got to be aware, just be alert the whole time and know what's happening. Rob is an inspiration. Just the, th the things that you take for granted that he can, can't do but it's so amazing what he can do and it's awesome to be able to be a part of that. Me and Rob always have um, a laugh about who's doing the most work. It's got to be distributed fairly evenly because we'd be fighting against each other and we wouldn't have a fluid motion. We do pretty much equal work. So damn it. At 49, Rob is in the best shape of his life. With the Paralympics in London just around the corner, they've got a training schedule to get them in peak form. 
I just like, like setting myself goals, and I think it's important for people to set themselves goals, no matter, no matter what, what level. I'm very ambitious. I, um, I, I want to do stuff, I want to achieve stuff, and um, you know, I want to be the best cyclist that I can be.